to mark this important holiday. During 2011, our Northern Nevada family was tested in so many ways. Throughout these challenges, I've been struck by the sense of community and the sense of optimism that is the hallmark of our state. It seems that when times are darkest, hope shines the brightest here in Nevada. We come together in unexpected and joyful ways. It's like Reverend King himself said, darkness cannot drive out darkness. Only light can do that. Hate cannot drive out hate. Only love can do that. Ladies and gentlemen, the spirit of Dr. King is alive and well. And the Nevada family exemplifies his beliefs. We are on the move again. And I've said it before, that if Nevada was a stock, I'd buy it now. <laughs> Thank you. I'm optimistic about our future because I've seen firsthand what Nevada's can and will do in time of crisis. As we pause tonight to reflect on the legacy of this great American, we can do so with pride in the examples of how the content of our community's character lives up to his dream. You need only look at our program tonight and read about the award winners and what they've done for our community and what they will continue to do. It's such an inspiration for me. So with that, ladies and gentlemen, thank you for being here tonight. Thank you for all that you do in our community, in our state. And thank you once again for giving me this honor and privilege of sharing this great evening with you. God bless all of you. God bless the great state of Nevada. And God bless the United States of America, the greatest nation on earth. Thank you.